Hello guys and welcome now to mission 6 of Ace Combat 7. In the previous mission we got introduced to the folks of the 444th, I guess, squadron, spare squadron. That was some crazy stuff, that was just so funny. And now let's see what happens in mission 6. Huge shout out to Crustmaster for sponsoring my channel and let's get this started. Mihai's granddaughters like to keep to themselves mostly. They were well behaved and possessed a sort of quiet elegance. From time to time, I'd catch myself looking at them, wondering what they were talking about. I'm sure everyone on the base did the same. They were such enthralling creatures. Every night, a crowd would gather around Mihai. They were the men tasked with guarding him in the air. Their jackets all bore the same patch, a relic from a nation that was long gone. Decades ago, during the Age of Expansion, the Kingdom of Erugia absorbed many countries. Theirs was one of them. Mihai asked them, Yet what is a nation? Can we actually see the physical lines that divide one from another? People of my generation can no longer speak the language of our homeland. My grandparents always look sad when they see I have no idea what they're saying to me. Mihai didn't say a word after that. His scarred face betrayed no emotion. He didn't get those scars from flying, though. Mihai was originally from Shilaji. His real name is Mihai Dimitru Margarita Cornelio Leopold Blanca Carol Aeon Ignatius Rafael Maria Nikitas A. Shilaji. When he was young, he was the heir to the Grand Duchy of Shilaji. Then, revolution broke out among his people. Mihai was betrayed by a close friend who pointed a gun at his face and pulled the trigger. The revolution was successful but the new country that sprang from it was annexed by the expanding kingdom of Arusia. The Arusian royal family allowed Mihai's family to retain their title and noble standing in the new kingdom. But Mihai surprised them all by signing up for the draft like an ordinary Arusian citizen. He was then accepted into the Air Force Academy by order of the king. Mihai soon became an ace pilot when the royal family was ousted and Arugia became a republic, he continued his service for the new regime. Test sites soon flourished. One day, a classmate of Mihai's granddaughter visited. I noticed the rose emblem. She laughed like a princess. And I found out later, she was indeed the daughter of Arugia's new ruler. She was the connection to the royal bloodline everyone was looking for, the one to restore the monarchy. This new princess was truly a godsend for the Arugian people. If Mihai's granddaughters were like the moon, she was like the sun, around which everything seemed to orbit. Her face was so expressive, it's no wonder the people of this war-torn country instantly felt at ease when they saw her speeches. They started singing. The pilots of the support plane smiled, even though they wished their nation were independent from hers. Angelic. I wonder how Mihai felt about all of this. It was my job to research his neurological data, after all. I wish I could figure him out. Whatever his feelings were about losing his homeland, he kept hidden. Even from me. That's a lot of lore material. Especially Mihai's name. That was long, man. Your mission is to atone for your crimes by attracting the enemy's attention. First, 
I want you to head from the base to the desert region of Roca Roja to the northwest. And then second, you will attack the large Arusian base there. We've been unable to verify that base's ability to deal with fighters. You will attack and provoke the enemy into revealing their AA strategy. Get them to fire at you as much as you can. That way, we can confirm where they're firing from. Then it's a case of sending in a regular force to clean them out. For this mission, we prepared a frontline base that could be used for ammo replenishment and aircraft repairs. However, this is not for you guys. Only the regular force has permission to use it. Even if you run out of ammo, don't forget that you're just decoys. You stay out there as targets for the enemy. What is this bullying simulator? Oh my god. Alright. Operation name, one pair. July the 4th, 2019. Happy Independence Day. Does OC have an Independence Day? Is it, is it July the 4th? I don't know, man. They just bully me. Oh my god. Alright. Let's go for a bit of a challenge. Let's go to MiG 21. The old. old. Oldie but a goodie. Oh. An external. Machine gun pod or rockets. Sam, let's go. Let's go rockets. Rockets are fun. Classic. And let's put the parts. The one that I still, the only one that I have. Let's go. Operations complete. Stand by at the front. All right, we're gonna go to uh, Roca Roja. It's like a desert. Of some sorts and just destroy the enemy forces and uh, hopefully not die. I can't see a damn thing. Better be careful. Some welcome. Mm, nice. The aircraft is spread out and attack. The lights and all. We're clear to attack, right? I heard the regular forces were gonna clean things up. It's just like before. We blow the shit out of everything. Sharp as attack, aren't you, Spare Aid? Regular forces can reduce losses if you tenderize the base first. If you can't handle that, just fly and be a target. Sure. <laughs> Thanks. Alright, so we gotta destroy 20,000 points worth of enemy targets. We're trying to take off. Think of the best way to rob Not today, buddy. To respond. Use those empty heads of yours. If you die too fast, you won't even be useful as targets. Transport truck spotted. The threat. Why are the guys are getting out alive? That's for you to figure out, Spare Seven. Thanks, Awax. No, that was bad. <laughs> that was bad. That I did not kill that AA gun. Dogs warming up. That was fast. Keep up the good work. Hostiles in your area are nearly wiped out. You can move into a more crowded area. Try to catch some of the lead. Their vehicles have been taken out. Move on to the next target. You're our official fly swatter now, Trigger. Alright, 
right, let's go for area number two. Finally have a read on the targets. This area is one hell of a place. I'll take you from here. Missile inbound. Evade. Hey, gun behind. Oh, bridge. Thanks, Alex. Running low on ammo, we might have to go back to the base. Which apparently we, they say we can't use, but we can. Target down. It's in the radar. The the return line. missile oh, there's some wind here Holy cow. Bend dog. Alright, let's go rearm and refuel. It's amazing how many people write their password on a note by their desk. Gathering it tell us all about right, skip this. We get to change our weapon. Uh let's go for the extra gun pods. Spare 15, you are cleared for takeoff. Get your ass in gear. Thanks. Tell us all about getting access. Alright, let's try it out. Oh, nice. Let's see how fast this boy can go. Gotta watch out for the wind. Sometimes there's wind around these mountains. That's can slow you down quite a bit. the last one. Fox 2, Fox 2! Holy! 
Apparently we had some Chinooks taking off. Nothing but trouble this mission, I'm afraid. Like a little destroyed all the trucks. So is he there? And we still have one more area to go. This is Barrel Evan. Enemy base dead ahead. Damn it, we can't do this from the sky. We need ground troops. Sparrow Eleven, just do your job. Just give us a bomb that's up to go here. There's more enemies. Thanks. Much appreciated. Am I supposed to get used to it? I was in. Oh, he has flares. It's not very maneuverable.
Alright, that's like, uh, just 1 minute and 30 seconds for me. I'm pretty sure I got more than three in this mission. Van Dog. The guard dog untouched. Don't make me take it back. Eradicate the rest of them. Seven down, that's more than an ace. Alright, well, ten seconds left. One less drone. There you go. Okay. Give the enemy base enough. Operation is complete. Head back. The bastards who flew off are going to wish they were never born. You guys get a pass. Damn right. I wouldn't be surprised if we're thrown in solitary too. Hey, who wants to bet who goes into solitary? That's what that gambling nut job would say if he was still here. <laughs> and he died. <laughs> Where's your sense of humor, guys? Your buddy's making a joke. Laugh already. <laughs> I can't see a damn thing. Better be careful. Alright. Let's see if they even mention High Roller, because he died. Like, oh yeah, that's normal. Just lost uh, a couple more guys today. You lost planes, but the mission succeeded. However, some of you crossed the return line for supplies and for repairs. This will result in solitary. Take them. What? I just wanted more ammunition! <laughs> Why you do that to me? I wonder, if I finish and they don't cross the line, am I, is it gonna be a different line? I, I don't know. Alright, this mission was pretty good in terms of... Uh, Wow, I got the S rank in terms of points. That was really good. I'm, I feel like I'm rich now, over 280 MRPs. Wow, awesome. That was good, that was good, that was good. More emblems. Hooray. That's it, Mission 6, Zombies Coma 7. That was a very large battle. Got a couple of points, quite a few of them. And we lost someone, but uh, you know, it's, it's fine. Just. This is a friend of yours died, but that's it. Hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have any comments, let me know in the comments section. And playlists and other things organized in the description. Also, again, huge shout out to Trustmaster for sponsoring my channel. They got some pretty good gear. Be sure to check out their store in the description. Also helps out the channel. Some very good stuff is there waiting for you. And I'll see you guys next time. Mission 7. Something tells me there's gonna be something big there. But yeah, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys there.